everything he wants to do. He doesn't want to give me more early on. A lot of guys will go here and put their hands in, so I don't have any, okay? As soon as you feel that, what I try to do is I get on my knees, and as I'm getting on my knees, I, I, I push his, his arms with my chest. You see what I'm doing? I push his arms with my chest, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my hand, and I'm going to go around his neck. As soon as I go around his neck, come around, I'm going to have to go all the way back. So I, I just go in a 69. When you go in a 69, I don't want to miss. This is all good. Right? You stay right in front of me. And I take my hand and I grab my own hand. Keep going. Don't get on his chest. Stay behind. Stay behind. I'm going to identify with his chin. You have to use the chin. And why is the choke is that? I'm going to go back. Back with my toe. How tight is that? I don't to choke. This is shoot. I can take this a couple of ways. I'm just taking, I'm teaching you the basics. A little later, I'm going to show you. That a lot of times, I go here and I bring my, 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 my leg back, my arm back, and guys want to come into me. And I got, this is what we teach in Jiu Jitsu, try to come up. As soon as they do that, I already got you. But for now, a lot of guys don't want to fight. I pass, he bring, he's got his hand just like this. Take your hand, I do it with my chest. As soon as the hands are here, because he doesn't want to give me anything. I take my chest and I push. I'm pushing him with my, with, with my chest, his arm, and I grab the top hand. As soon as I feel that, that, I, that I'm on top of him already, I put it in, I turn, as I turn, all I want is my armpit. My armpit is underneath his neck. You can adjust, you can do whatever you need to do. How tight does that feel already? It's pretty tight already. Got it going to 69. As soon as I go on to 69, this is back. Yeah, I can breathe there. You step, go back, and watch why he and want you want to grab him. You know, sometimes he can go underneath, put one hand underneath my neck, and just push away while I start pressing. Now I guys are free, you know what I mean? If you feel like you need to start to you turn your head in, turn your head in, and watch my toes, watch my toes. <laughs> if you don't do it right, and I start messing around, if I'm sitting here like this and I'm not doing it right, I want you to take his hand this way. I want you to hoop up and throw me to that side. And that was pretty easy for him to do. So don't mess around. As soon as I got, as soon as I got the submission, as soon as I got the submission, I'm gonna put my weight down, put my head down, and I try to throw me over. He can't. Here, as soon as, I, as soon as I feel, I start going back. The more I go back, I just take my toes and I pull them back. And the whole thing is you should feel like you're forming the, the back of his neck, and it should feel like it's a pillow for him. And then you gotta just crack it open, it looks like that. And that's when he's gonna tap. So it's wrong to put your weight on top of the guy. Don't put the weight on top of the guy. Keep your weight right behind him, behind his chest. That's what I try. Hey, 